what does it mean to see yourself? What does it mean to see yourself as a part of history? What does it mean to see yourself represented? And what does it mean for yourself to see yourself in a painting? I am Mario Moore. I'm an artist in residence at Duke. So when Duke asked me to do a residency, I wanted to make sure I had enough time to interact with the people that I was going to paint. One of the reasons I wanted to paint students at Duke was when we think about who we are gonna honor, oftentimes those people are not young. What does it mean for a young person to see themselves represented? What, what can that, that do to their conscience? What can that do to seeing themselves within a painting history? When Duke asked me to do a commission of Wilhelmina Rubin Cook, I was really excited and I was honored, but I had to do my research to find out more about who she was. Found out that she was part of the first five black students to graduate from Duke University. So I talked to her husband and her daughter um, and that inspired uh, what you see in the building today, what you see in the painting. Um, so I'm really, really honored and thankful that Duke gave me this opportunity to paint Wilhelmina Rubin Cook. The National Museum, which is an incredible place and, and something I wanted to see for a long time. In my mind, I see evidence of Matisse cutouts, right? The kind of um, information that the structure of the elements all kind of situate themselves individually. And then when you look at over, overall, it comes together. She's also using spray paint, um, which is very different from what she was using before. Uh, very much you can see her hand in the process of painting. Um, and I think what this does is kind of, in a way, removes the, the, the kind of gestural hand that you know, I really depend on as, as I make my work. Um, but it, it leaves you with just the, the image. Visiting Central was a great experience. It was really, really cool to meet the students, to see what they were working on. As a young artist, you know, you're looking at Instagram, you're looking on the internet, you're seeing all these detailed eyeballs, right? And you're like, man, I want to do that. But I think you get there actually by letting go of some of your control. For me, the inspiring thing is always meeting young artists and seeing them in the moment of uh, origin and the moment of creating, right? It's like this transformation. Um, so, so that was really, really great with the visit. My time here has been really amazing in terms of the work that I've made. It's allowed me to revisit a material that I haven't um, used in, in years of small works on copper. Usually I'm not able to get people to sit for me. Um, so that, that's been really amazing. And I feel like that what I've experienced here and the work that I've made uh, in this short amount of time is just kind of preparing me for that next body of work. Thank you.